Hello everyone, I'm Manuel aka Dogocraft and welcome to my new YouTube channel. Actually, this is my first time on YouTube, I decided to start this new brand, Minecraft Survival Series. And as you can see from here, this is an amazing Terralith death pack that I would like to try out. So the goal of this series is basically to, yeah, mainly enjoy the game together, have a look at this amazing terrain generation. It's basically my vanilla Minecraft with the same blocks, right? So no changes in blocks. The system is replacing blocks everywhere to have a better yeah, terrain generation, new biomes and, and things that we can play around. As you can see, this is really good. I also have complementary shaders to have a little bit better look. I, I really enjoy liking uh, playing with that. And yeah, but we, I will tell you a little bit more along the way. I mean, look at this cavern. I mean, this, this data pack, it's, it's stunning, guys. Yeah, it's definitely amazing. Look at this. Oh, a lot of guys down there, guy. <laughs> okay, so let's get some hood um, and I will get this started. So first of all, of course, get some hood here. I mean, this is a big tree, yeah, never mind. So we need to get food. Um, so the best way definitely for early games, if we cannot find animals, is definitely go to some water source and find some fish over there. And that's definitely the easiest way to get to get food in the early games. Yeah, so as I mentioned, tools, food, um, and then we need to find iron at some point, I guess. We need armor, and also we need to find a really cool place to, to settle in. Um, yeah, exactly. Perfect. So, uh, yeah, so as me know the, uh, uh, from my accent, I'm Italian. I mean, my English skills are not, you know, stunning, but I think are good enough. But of course, I will do some, some few error mistakes here and there. I hope you, you understand. And uh, yeah, so I decided to do it in English because I think it's more international. I can get, um, I mean, I can reach more people, right? Uh, that can understand the videos and things, even if they are not coming from England, United States, or any English native speaking country. Um, so yeah, um, yeah. So I think this is already quite good. I don't. I'm not going to chop all this tree uh, at all. <laughs> um, so let's get some wood tools. And then we start to look for some fish or some animals around here. We need also to get stone, right? Because, but yeah, guys, I'm super excited about this new project. Uh, I'm not a full-time YouTuber uh, or gamer at all. Um, so I have a full-time job, so I will do that, you know, when I have time. Of course, I will be consistent. I want to build a lot of things. Actually, I have a, a really cool plan for the series. Um, but that, what for sure, I'm not going to build, you know, mega builds and crazy things because I know that I cannot handle it. I cannot complete them mostly. So I want to, to stay a little bit more feasible. Do some really good, I mean, look at this biome. I mean, this is, this is, looks so good, man. Look at that. Uh, yeah, so I want to keep this feasible, right? So build things that are actually I can finish. Um, but yeah, we will go through all the, all the main steps of the, of Minecraft for sure. I want villager, you know, I actually really like playing with villager. So I prefer playing with villager than having kind of crazy mob farms and stuff. I mean, this is... Yeah. You know how this blocks, replacing blocks. I mean, I definitely need melons because the first farmer will definitely... Uh, pumpkin in a melon farm, which gave me a lot of potential with the villager. Ah, uh, this is really nice. And also we need to find food we mentioned, right? So I see no fish around here. Not sure why. Ah, there, over there. I just saw them. Okay, let's get some fish. Come here, man. Yeah, sorry, good cause. There are also some bad guys down there. Um, more fish. Yeah, I just mentioned, yeah, fish is the easiest way to get food. Wow, no fish. Okay, so maybe we get a boat. 
I mean, bad, it's okay, but I think we can hide in some, some holes, some caverns, if we are not able to find ships. What do you want from me? No. 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 This is a f entire family down here. Come on. Yeah. Don't bother me. I need food and I will leave. Ah, look look at this. This is a blackstone, right? Blackstone generating in that way. I mean, it's amazing. Sun is about to set. Okay. That's a problem. Let, let's let's get in in some hole here. Because yeah, oh, perfect. There is also coal. And then we will wait for the the day. And then we will definitely come out to look for some bed. Okay, so I will um, prepare my hiding here, and I will back to to you as soon as I'm done. Okay, look what I found, iron. So I was waiting, you know, for for the day to come in I was looking for some resources we got some coal and while diving down we found this amazing iron veins yep that's actually perfect for us uh, yeah it's not a lot but it's a good start right really really good okay so we need to find sheeps um, and also make a bed Oh, there is bamboo. I will get that. I mean, I don't really need now, but that's fine. I will get it. But yeah, I mean, I think we need we need to go um, on the land because ooh, look what we have found. Aha, uh -huh, that will is really really interesting. But of course, we cannot handle now. So we will take a screenshot of this, and we will definitely come back. Um, so let's go to the land. Oh, free cold. I get it. Okay, thank you. Um, okay, in the meantime, that we try to find the sheep under this rain, um, I will tell you a little bit more by myself. I mean, I'm Italian, as I mentioned. I have a family, two kids, dog. Um, yes, I. I mean, as you saw from my my thumb and my channel name I really love them um, I have a dog Argentino uh, now only one unfortunately because one passed away uh, just before the last Christmas yeah it was was really tough um, yeah after almost 11 years together yeah it's really um, was re was really hard I would say um, okay creeper no I don't want to do anything with you um, exactly Wow, okay, this place, it's unbelievable. Um, exactly, so uh, as I mentioned, we are from Italy, but we relocated to Switzerland three years ago. And actually, it's an amazing country. Uh, no sheep around here. Oh, Lush Cave. Oh, that's really good. Let's see if, let's, let's have a quick look if there is some iron. I don't see any iron around here. Let's have a quick look. Because without armor we can die quite easy. Yeah, why we relocated? Yeah, mainly because, I mean, when our kids were born, we definitely found, you know. Um, oh, skeleton. We couldn't find, you know, our, our place there. I don't know, it's... I mean, Italy is not that easy to live. It's not an easy country. It's pretty messy. Um, it's really... Oh, ship, that's what I was looking for. I s oh, oh! There is also a bunch of bad guys that are going to kill me. Oh, we can make a shield actually. Yes, let's make a shield and get rid of these monsters real quick. Shield. Yes, we can make it. Okay. Perfect. So we, we are going to kill them, take the sheep, and make a bed. That's the plan. Okay, zombie. Come on. Bye-bye. 
Yes, come here. Ciao. Skelly, it's your turn. Bye, Skelly. And now the ships. No, it's... I have only one white. There is one black here. So we need two black or two white. Ooh, a creeper. Oh, guys, this is a busy area. Let's go. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. Be, be, be. Oh, there is white sheep. You are mine. Come on, zombie. We need one piece. Oh, creeper. I heard him. Okay, that's a busy area. We are safe, apparently. A um, lot of calcite. This is good because I really like build with them. I mean, I'm I'm a builder, I would say. Um, I really enjoy building and and detailing things. So definitely, will you will find uh, a lot of that here. But as I quickly mentioned, I will not go in for crazy giant project because I want to get things done, given my available time. Ah, creepers everywhere. Creepers everywhere. Let's get out of here. This is where we are going to die. That's not a good choice. We, I, I would like to build in a, in a specific biome in this Terralit data pack. And basically it's it's like a sprucey biome filling with some... Basically there are also some dark oak trees. And the dark oak trees are getting red leaves. So basically you see a... I don't remember exactly the name of the biome, but we will find out soon. I mean, this is a jungle on a mountain, okay, cool, cool. And the look and feel, it's really, really good, trust me, it's amazing. You will see that, maybe you already saw, but that's definitely my favorite biome. Uh, um, I want to build there. And Also, you can use that for decoration, you know, um, red and, 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 and green, different tonality of green. Um, yeah, so I wanted to find that biome and build there. This is a random seed, so I have no idea what's going on and what are those places. I just want to play freestyling and, and explore things um, with you. So if I don't like to, to plan too much... Oh my god. And What's that? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's that? What's going on in this biome, man? Ooh, there is a creeper party. Creepy party. Probably will spend the night in the boat. <laughs> I mean, spending the night in the boat in the ocean is definitely better than just close ourselves in a hole. If I go on land, it's basically a dead sentence without armor. Especially in hard mode, they're full of mobs over the night. Um, yeah. Okay, this is an impressive cliff. Look at this with this coral down here, the lava. I mean, this cliff is really good. Okay, guys, sunrise. It's coming. And uh, yeah, seems that we are moving and we are changing biome. So this is kind of a mountain. Maybe there is iron also here. So that could be interesting, but I don't see it. Let's see if the biome that I mentioned before, not exactly that one, but is going that direction. So I guess we need to go up here. To check this out. Yes, I saw red trees, so that could be definitely um, our place. Let's check this out. Um, so we mentioned we need a sheep. Let's hope to find something here. Also, we need a little bit of food. Yes, exactly. So what I mentioned before, I want to find a really cool biome where we have these spruce and dark oak trees. And this is kind of the fact, right? So it's really contrasty. And then you can use that leaves for decoration and stuff. 
So we definitely want to build a starter house. Um, we also want to build, um, you know, the deep slate mountain are really good. Um, so starter house, definitely we want to build um, a villager breeder as soon as possible uh, to get um, the villager situation sorted uh, with zombification, of course, because we need discounts. Um, yeah, um, exactly. So def definitely it will be the first things. Then we need a pumpkin melon farm with farmer. Uh, we can get XP and progress uh, along the way. Oh, there is a village. Perfect. Oh, th look at these caves. I mean, this is good, huh? Let's go to that village and then let's explore a little bit around here. Because that could be a nice potential biome. Oh, there is a plenty of iron. This is a good news. Let's grab this iron. Because, I mean, as soon as we have a full iron armor, we can definitely go in the caves and have a lot of fun. And gather resources and get everything sorted for our first build. Yeah, the style of the, my first build will be kind of a stony, woody house, a little bit overgrown, you know, um, something like you, you saw, I don't know if you saw, but I, actually one of my first video I posted in this channel was that um, kind of long play of uh, overgrown house. Yeah, maybe something like this, I would say. Um, yeah. I mean, this is kind of a village inside. Oh. There is a lot of andesite in this pack. And actually it's it's good because I really like using it for building. Yes, we have a bed. Thanks. I will we will grab both actually. Oh no, let's grab only one. So we have bread. Okay. I think we can get rid of this for now. Definitely need apples. And uh, we need... Oh, we already have three, three seeds. That's fine, okay. I think we can hang out a little bit here because this is a really good cave valley, you know. So we can hang out a little bit. Let's, let's have some um, iron cooking. Yeah, and in the meantime, we can explore that a little bit. Cartographer. Compass, I don't need a compass now, yeah. Um, over here, more food. This is a dangerous place. Beep, beam, okay, so let's build an armor. Have a look around here. Let's see if there are some easy to get resources. And then we will move and find a place to build. I mean, look at this. Okay, and also I, I'm playing with the replay mod. Um, I'm not ready yet. Um, I, I mean, it's quite tricky to learn, but definitely is something that I want to use. I want to this kind of cinematic shots, you know. Um, let's see if I can make it uh, for the first episode. I mean, definitely you will see. Um, yeah, probably. If I was able to make it, you will see already at the beginning of this episode, I guess. Um, yeah, so what we can get, definitely, I want a chest plate. That's definitely my first iron tool. And then probably, I mean, we have a shield. Maybe a sword and a pickaxe. So we can pick some stuff around here. Okay, I think we are almost ready to go up. Uh, no more iron, so yeah, party finished. Let's go up. Yep, good. Oh, there is a part of that village. Oh, come on, man, look. There is a little bit here, a little bit is spread in this cave system, in this cliff systems. There's a plenty of iron also. Hmm, a cat. <gasps> there are villagers stuck everywhere. <gasps> Unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, I really like this biome because there are a lot of stone 
And those trees remind me, I don't know, a little bit, you know, kind of this real place. You know, when you are kind of thousand, thousand meters and something in the mountain, right? Where you have this rocky with a lot of greenery uh, on the ground because you are, um, you are starting to be really high. And with those trees, a bit empty with stony stuff, you know. And also you see how slabs are generating um, with this mode pack, resource pack, whatever. Also these kind of small water sources are generating in this biome. There is also another village, yeah, so I think this is, this is the place. Facing east. So we have the sunrise and the sunset will be below the mountain, so... Mm. I would prefer something with the sunset, actually. But yeah, we can have something on the sunrise. So let's have a look quickly here, in this village, and then I think we can start find our place. There is also more over there. Let's go up here, see what's going on in this area, and then we'll probably start settling. I need... Yeah. Not bad. Let's get Chuck that that side of the area and then we have a pretty good understanding of oh there is a kind of birch forest also here. I mean I don't mind about the birch trees in this way. They don't look too bad. I mean I know that probably some of you are going to kill me. But actually Hmm that's because I, I like the sunset here. Let's let's do like that. Let's build on the other side, because we'll be kind of the main side where we can actually build m more than one build, right? So we can create kind of small village for us, and then um, we can come up here and maybe and maybe build some cabin or or maybe some fishing spot where we can fish, you know, and enjoy the sunset or something. And then we are going there. Yeah, that's really nice. Area. And when we, we're going to settle that there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I think we can start from here. Hmm? Okay, so we'll prepare my setup, some chest, so let's prepare a working station around here and then we we start building a little starter house or guys so I clean up a little bit the area uh, I think for now it's good enough so we can get our build here and then we can um, terraform a little bit the terrain around here and also maybe d create a staircase that is going down so I will gather some resources um, for the building which is mean basically wood stone and this kind of stuff um, I will prepare everything here um, and then we will come back uh, start the start the building. Let's say together, right? So I will start my my building process um, while recording, and then we will finish up with um, with a time lapse or something to to speed up a little bit. So guys, um, see you in a bit. I will go gather some resources and back ready for building. Cheers. Okay, here we are. So resources acquired. As you can see here, um, yeah, we got, we smelled a little bit of cobblestone, we have stone, we found some mossy on the side, and we, we have a bunch of hood, and then we can get this started. I just spent some time just around here, I didn't go caving or doing crazy stuff, because I want to keep that for um, another episode. Um, we also smelted a little bit of iron, so we can complete our armor which is missing my pants, yes. Another pickaxe maybe, and the shovel, and then here we are, okay, good. 
the idea is to show you a little bit the process at the beginning build one facade of the house and then we can um, we can uh, go into a time lapse to, to quickly finish the building. I mean, it's it's still really cool even if the sun is on the other side, right? And let's get this started. The, the idea is to build a house over here. Actually, I got rid of another grass layer, a terrace here where we can enjoy the sunrise. Um, so what I would like to do is having, for example, and having like one, two, three, four, five, right? Six, seven, maybe, right? So we have a little bit more space inside. And then we can go um, maybe 11, one, two, no, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, I think, eh, not bad. Let's do 13th. So we have kind of much. A little bit more space inside so we can have for example the kitchen um, a small bedroom and a little bit of storage so this starter house I I mean um, I think I will go with just one floor so we can complete this quite fast and not using a bunch of materials and that it's definitely good enough for um, a starting um, a starter house we can maybe open something here right so we can have for example here right and then here we can have the terrace yeah sounds good here another five so three four five six seven sorry and then we can close in one two three and maybe here we can have a little bit of entrance so we can do one two three maybe four so we can kind of a double door here Let's do five and then let's see. One, three, four, five. And then we can close this up in this way here. Yeah, not bad. So we can have the entrance here. We can use even use a double door, for example. We can use some, some decoration stuff around here. Uh, maybe what we can do is pillar in this way so we can instead of having the pillars you know in line here we can have actually the pillar a little bit like this let's see yeah yeah okay let's see actually it could be could be good huh let's see if this makes sense okay and then here we can come and have a kind of you know um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, wide. It's too much? Yeah, maybe it's too much. I want to work. One, two, three, four, five. Let's let's do five and see. For example, it's too little. A small version, and then we can ex expand if we want, right? Exactly, so it will be something like this, supporting. We can even eventually break that a little bit and having um more distance actually I, I usually usually don't build with external pillars but i want to give it a try um okay so this is what kind of would be kind of the foundation you know the scheme and i don't know to say in english the you know the layout yeah and then we can build this facade and see how it looks and then um we jump into the time lapse right so here eventually right we want to do a little bit of you know, um, texturing also, right? So we want just to go here, for example, like this. And then we can, oh, stone. Yeah, something like that. And then we can um, use already the stone maybe here. On the side, stone, and yeah, here, how many? One, two, three, four, five. Let's see. Okay, 
This would be five, right? Something like this. Yeah, it's a little bit random. Yeah, not bad. Okay. And then if we go up here, we can actually like mix spruce, stripped spruce with oak, not stripped. So I will I will show you what I mean by. So for example, let's say that we go five here, right? And then we do something like this. And then we strip this. See, it looks quite good. And eventually we can even do something like this. Um, so let's create some some barrel. Don't remember the rest. I mean, it's so bad with the recipes, guys. Eh? Uh, yeah, some barrel. We definitely, we need them. And we can even use them for, you know, to put them here, for example, like, boom, right? So you can build pillars in this way. And we have our pillars with a little bit more character, right? Um, let's build this one also. Sorry, guys, my, my voice. Um, I got a cold during these days. So I'm still a little bit sick. Um, but I wanted to, to, to get this started and finished. Um, because I actually have some times, and uh, considering my, <laughs> you know, that I don't have a plenty of time in general. Um, it's better to, to 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 start even if my wife and and myself are not 100%. Okay, so this is the facade. We can also open up a window, right? Maybe we can open maybe one. Um, I thought about using dark um, dark oak. For the um, the first uh, line of the roof, let's grab some 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 dirt so we can pillar up a little bit. Um, do like this. Dit, dit, dip. Okay. Here, um, actually, I would like to mix. I would like to do a mix them this way, so we can have darker stairs. We can have um, planks and dark oak hood in this way. And then we can mix the line. Um, maybe, maybe, maybe we need also slab. So the line, it's sunning setting. Um, what we can do is just, for example, starting in this way. And then we can use like, you know, boom. I like to, to have kind of really blocky and, and things here. Um, maybe we can have a stair, another plank, maybe a stair, maybe this one and this one. We can go up two. So we have one, one, two, and eventually in the middle we can go with, with three if we want. One, two. And oh, actually we're already in the middle, so let's do three. But let's do something like this for now. And then go to sleep. So we have one, one, two, and three. Okay. Ah, oh, man. This, actually the sunrise is really good. I thought we, I think we, we pick up a really nice place. Uh, okay, so I think it's not bad. Then we can maybe play around a little bit with texture and even, you know, strip something if we want. Here we say that we have one, one, two, and three, right? One, one, two, and three. So we have one, one, two, and three. Exactly. I mean, we can even use tear here, but let's see. Um, good, and then here maybe we'll use um, dark oak log here in the middle. Um, I'm not sure yet. Let's get this line he here and then see how it looks like. Um, also, we need to cover this part. Here we have two option. We can do a double a double line, roof double line. So basically filling this 
space here with another subline of this one, maybe with another hood, could be an option, or um, or expand basically the, um, the stone here. Let's see if we close the roof here, what will happen? For example, I, um, I think that's not a little best place for stairs. Um, like here, we can strip this. Um, and then we can, for example, do this. Let's see. Hmm. Double. And then we have also here. Something like this. And we can strip this, maybe this, this. Okay. Um, yeah, let's see the dark oak strip if it makes sense to do it or no. Um, but that, that could be could be the line. And here we can eventually put something to fill this gap. Yeah, I think it's not bad. I, I mean, I really like it. Uh, we can also use this space, you know, that we create for decoration. Um, the line is, um, yeah, I like it. Also, of course, here we will have, you know, um, the upside down stairs, and then we can move upside down in this in this way. Um, okay, let's get started with the time lapse and then see you then. Here we go, yes, we finish almost our amazing starter house, which is fitting my opinion perfectly with the environment so we have sprucey dark oak red and green leaves uh, a little bit of stone and i think it um i think it's re really cool really cool so here i still need to figure out what hang here i mean i, re I really like hanging stuff here but i i have no idea um so as you can see here we have a little bit of a decoration window you know a little bit of fences and and stuff, signs here and there, just to fill the spaces, a little bit of roof, uh, kind of an entry working area, um, some lanterns here and there, it is oh, here, so here I will probably build a chimney, something, uh, which is missing also, um, here it's a little bit the same, um, here we have this beautiful terrace with this amazing view oh what's going on with that fish oh, okay um exactly uh so we will probably maybe refine that a little bit more a little bit more you know cozy but it is i think it's really good this is our interior pretty basic we have our kitchen i still need to to put some also another all more details maybe some you know stuff on the wall our starter um, inventory and the bad, I mean, poor bad. This is pretty sad. So I will do something definitely also on this corner and we miss glass also because we don't have sand. A little bit of path here. Uh, I am, yeah, just, just a little, um, just to give that feeling of homey, but I will uh, definitely come up with a nice path um, to see where we can connect the building and also I need to finish here which is a little bit rough so I want definitely to have a little bit more polished uh, terrace but overall I think I like it um, yeah I like it I need to find some I like light on the roof so I need to find a way to put some lights over there maybe something in the middle yeah not sure but yeah so this is, um, let's go quickly to sleep, but this is, guys, it's where I finish and I will end this episode, my first episode, I'm super excited, 
so thank you very much for watching and please subscribe if you want to support me and um, yeah I will uh, start working on the second episode which will basically be mining a little bit uh, because we need to uh, we are pretty poor we don't have anything so we will do a mining session and eventually we refine and redetail um, improve a little bit the detail in the house as well but yeah let's say um, hello with this amazing night bye guys thank you very much <laughs>